hello and welcome to jasonnewland.com my name is Jason Newland and um, hello how are you today I hope you're well and this is my daily hypnosis session and if you've seen me before or listened to me before you know that there won't necessarily be complete silence <laughs> as we speak there's a car parking in the car park behind my house so that's okay that's just the way things are and tough <laughs> I think is the right word it doesn't matter you don't need there to be complete silence for you to really benefit from the positive suggestions that you can take on board and integrate into your mind and into your life. So today, today's been a strange day for me and just found out that I'm going to lose quite a bit of work due to lack of funding you know in the UK and this may seem irrelevant to you but to me it's fairly important and it's got me thinking about about feeling positive about the future it's got me thinking uh, to remember that actually this is a short term issue and there's more to life than work or money But there's more to life than these things that maybe we worry about. And I got to thinking of someone that, that died a few years ago. And this is somebody that I did uh, hypnosis with to help them with uh, anxiety of having medical treatment and also help with the pain connected with their condition. And this is uh, the husband of a friend of mine who passed away. And that person was the same age as me, in their early 40s, as I am, and I guess that that person would much rather be in my situation than the situation that he was in. And although the future is not mapped out necessarily, and although we don't always know what the future holds, the fact is 
for each of us have a future and for those that don't have a future they would rather be us with a future And this may seem morbid, but going to a funeral of someone that's only 41 or 42 years old, someone that I was doing hypnosis with a couple of months earlier to help them to relieve the physical pain they were experiencing. And to also be at the same age now as they were when they passed away. Kicks in a kind of reality. Of how things really are. A reality of appreciation. For what I actually have. For what you actually have. Instead of concentrating on things that we don't have. Maybe. We could Think about the things that we do have in our lives. The things that really do mean something to us. And there's something special about that. Something quite amazing about that, in fact. When we really can allow yourself to get in touch with the reality of how you feel right now, right this second, the reality of how your life is now. And that can really change how you feel. That can really change the sensations that you experience now it's really interesting that you can allow yourself to get in touch with the changes that naturally occur when you really begin to appreciate the life that you do have now. And I wonder what that will be like for you as you ponder and wonder and consider the fact that things are okay in some way and that things are better than some other people have it. And I wonder what that's like for you to really be in touch with the reality that you really can appreciate what you have and you really can appreciate what you have accomplished in your life. And you really can appreciate being you. Enjoy the rest of the day feeling wonderful.